Hello guys, this is Cameron C here, or you know, also known as Baby Einstein5273. And today we are going to be doing a special, another review. Only this time, it's not a BE toy. Uh, I actually decided to actually do like a. I actually decided to do this for a little bit while, but I just couldn't find the the best time to do so. Well, I feel like it's actually now, but. Today we are actually going to do these four Baby Einstein um, books. They're like um, bathtub-like books. I, I actually had these ever since I was little, and I actually thought these were actually pretty interesting. Anyways, I believe there are four of them, at least. That's literally how many I have right now. We have what's floats. No, and obviously I'm not going to be reading it to you. This is not a read-along video or anything, so. Oh, no. Oh, wait. On the page. And then, you know, on the back, I have to cover this up because, you know, that's my last name on there. Yeah, it's pretty interesting. Um, I don't think this no, no, this one doesn't, so I can show you the rest of them on the back. So here's Water, Water Everywhere. I actually like this scenery right here. Probably my favorite in the book. We have Who Lives in the Pond, which is possibly my favorite one out of the four. Seriously, why wasn't this a BE character? Or this, or even this. Like, I got so many questions about this book right now. Could that, could that be a Vivaldi's uh, cousin or something? Or older brother, I don't know. I'm always curious to see what would that beaver always be in B.E. puppet-like. That I'm always curious about. Oh, and even a pink lizard. Hmm. And also here's those water bug thingies. I forgot what the name are, but... It's a pretty cool book. And then the last one is Mimi Toes. Of course, any book that we see always have to involve either Mimi or Violet. But yeah. This one's an okay book. But these are possibly my favorite type of books that I have right now in the moment. Even though I did stop collecting BE books since 2013. But yeah, these are pretty interesting. I had these ever since I was a little baby, so. And I still have them today, so. They're actually pretty cool. Um, I think it's only... I'm not sure who else has these, but I think BE2003, also known as uh, Sage, also has them. I'm not sure who else has them, though. But if you do have these books, let me know in the comment section below. But yeah, I'm probably not going to be re reviewing this these on my channel. Unless if it's like... Actually... Now, since I thought about it, maybe I should have reviewed them on my channel when it, I did a Neptune review. Well, actually, I never did a Neptune review. So, you know, I'm gonna, I'll have to do that uh, next year just to make up the last two or three reviews I never actually got to do. But, um, yeah. Just, to, but yeah, just a last reminder, guys, this channel is not just about, uh, the toy reviews. This is all about, like... Um, like DVDs and VHSs and books and like anything VE review, like anything VE I'll review. Not just toys, like VHSs and DVDs too. But I'm gonna get to those soon. Right now, in the moment, I'm just collecting. To to I'm just going to um, continue toys probably up till like I don't know. I'm po I'm possibly gonna start like doing these like other reviews maybe like soon. Don't know when, but I'll let you guys know. Like, once you see a video on, my on this channel about it. 
But, uh, yeah, um, I think that's about it, guys, for this, uh, five-minute video. But if you guys enjoyed this video and, or this review, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and also subscribe to my other channel. I'll possibly leave a link in the description below, or soon, in that case. But, in any case, this is, uh, Cameron C. Sun out, or also known as Baby Asset 5273. Bye.